the stats every minute this week. I'm doing my part, I'm paying attention, and I play my position. Right, let's talk about Ito. I T O is the ticker on this particular dog meme coin. Okay, guys. Now this is a Nero play. Now Nero, obviously, many of you watching the channel would know what Nero is by now. Okay, Nero is the biggest meme coin of this cycle, or one of the biggest meme coins of this cycle, up and coming. Let's say the latest meme coin of this cycle. Uh, there's a few different versions of the Nero token. You have it on Solana. You have uh, a couple of versions on Ethereum. Okay, guys. So the Nero that we're going to look at is first Nero on Ethereum, which is the Nero that recently launched on Binance. I believe that it may be. Uh, no, it's not this one. Uh, let's just pull up the correct Nero first. Let's type in first Nero okay um so first nero on ethereum we're looking for nero 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 and this is the thing when these tokens come out you just get a bunch of them you don't even know you know you, sometimes you just don't know which is the one that i should be buying all right but fortunately this is not a nero video we're talking about uh ito in this video so let's just see let's just see if we can find the correct nero um before we move on with the okay so this is the nero wow currently sitting at 739 million on its way to a billion dollar market cap this thing is going crazy okay guys so what you see over here we saw the binance launch binance pumped this all the way up to about three 400k uh, 400 million market cap now it's sitting at 740 million market cap didn't even realize that that is pumping right but anyway so we all know what happened with nero okay um finance is taking this to a billion dollar market cap so we're going to talk about a token called ito now ito is from the same deployer as nero okay guys i believe it was actually created before nero um and the uh, the proof is on the blockchain, okay, guys. But not only that, right? So what happened with Nero? I believe that Vitalik, uh, you know, Buterin, the Ethereum founder, sold some of his Nero or all of his Nero and donated a portion of that to charity. What happens is the people that create these coins they send a portion of the supply to Vitalik because many people are watching Vitalik's wallet and hoping that Vitalik will interact with the token. So Vitalik interacted with the token on first Nero, sold the tokens, and then people started to people started to get hype and bullish on the actual narrative. Binance went and listed the token. This went absolutely crazy, right? Not only that, first Nero is a CTO, and you have the Cabal versus CTO narrative, right? Um, many of you watching will know what I'm talking about, right? But he's gone ahead and he's done the same thing with itos now the, again the nero deployer deployed both of these tokens it's the same deployer as you see that it says here and then what we have is vitalik right uh sold 50 percent of his tokens two days ago on this particular project and since then it's been going up right so you can see the this is the transaction here okay i've already got it open but let's just refresh that right this is the transaction here where vitalik uh vitalik.eth he sold about 17 ethereum worth of the uh ito token ito and i believe that he's probably going to donate that to charity as you can see um from vitalik to uh this wallet you know uh, or whatever forty two thousand dollars, which will probably go to charity and obviously the blockchain warriors the blockchain watchers are watching these sorts of things and they notice that and this you know ever since then this has been pumping right pumping a little bit now right it's only sitting at 5.29 million dollar market cap by the way okay so it's still at a very good price point for you to be able to make some pretty large gains if this was to do anything like what we've seen nero do right there's a lot of X's involved there, right? It's currently just under a billion. If this goes just to just under a billion, you do the math on that, right? Uh, not that it's guaranteed that it will do that, right? 
but um, the narrative is there for this particular token. Now, the second thing I want to talk about is why, how, how does this all match up as well? Well, Nero and Ito are actually the same dog as well, okay? So Ito is actually the original name of the Nero dog before it became Nero. Now, if you don't know who Nero is and Ito is, right? Uh, Kabosu is the dog, the Dogecoin dog. That is the dog for Dogecoin, right? And the person that owned Dogecoin, uh, well, Doge, the, sorry, the person that owned Kabosu, the dog of Dogecoin, uh, they bought a new dog because the dog of Dogecoin actually died. So Nero was the new dog. Now, Ito was the name of the dog before it was taken, I believe, into the homeless shelter or whatever it is, right? The dog shelter. And she, uh, you know, and so this is basically uh, the new dog, right? Uh, and, and then it was renamed from Ito to uh, uh, Nero. Okay, guys. Now, so now people are talking about Itoba. Right, October, right now it's October, everyone expects a pump in October. Okay, guys, so there's a lot going for this particular meme coin, this narrative, and uh, that's why I'm bullish on this one. I hope you've been following me because I've been a bit all over the place with that story, right? But if we look at the chart, for example, right, the chart is looking very bullish. This is also a community takeover, right? Um, so this was launched actually on the 29th of july august september october so we're like four months into this token right the distribution looks pretty good on chain as well if i must say okay if we go over to the blockchain let's see what the bag holders are looking like on this particular token it's 1653 holders right and if you go over here okay there are a few uh whales in this token already however when you look at the blockchain you realize that Outside of Uniswap, Vitalik is still the top holder of Ito. Okay, guys, why? Why did he only sell half of his uh, Ito tokens, right? He still has 14 billion of these tokens, 3.3% of the supply, which is a very good narrative for this project as well. Okay, guys, now you have this other person who owns 3%. Don't know who that is, okay, guys, but then the top holder after that is the burn address where 2.73% of the supply was burnt and sent to the dead address. Now, outside of these particular, tra these four top holder transactions here, right? So you have Vitalik, who we're not worried about. You have the dead address, who we're not worried about. Then you have these two addresses, which account for 5% of the supply, 3% and a 2%. And outside of that, nobody else has more than 2% of the supply. In fact, the 21 top holders control 1% up to 3% of the supply each. And after the top 20 holders, one of which is the, uh, uh, no, that's 21 holders. Yes, so after the top 20, right, nobody owns 1%, more than 1% of the supply in this token. So the distribution looks pretty okay, 1,653 holders. So looking at all of this, right, I would say that this is a very bullish altcoin, right? and. As you can see, it's in an uptrend. So there's another bullish metric. The volume is increasing, right? So with all of that being said, right? Now, bearing in mind, this all happened over the weekend on the 5th of October. Vitalik sold some of his tokens. So many people were able to get in before the multitude start rushing into this thing, right? Um, and, and now the opportunities are there. People are starting to tweet about it, talk about it. You know, many people are on their weekend breaks. They're chilling. They're out clubbing. They're doing whatever it is that they do. And it, some people miss this news. They miss this play, right? But it's not too late. It's still pretty early. It's $5.3 million market cap. I do see this trading above a $50 million market cap, potentially $100 million, right? And if this obviously gets onto one of the top exchanges, you know, this is the kind of thing that we can expect to see, right? Potentially, especially if it gets to Binance. Now, I think it's got a lot going for it. Especially for the simple fact that Vitalik is still holding, you know, he's still the top holder in his project for some reason. For some reason, he's probably just fed up of giving money away, right? He knows that he can sell half the token and people will still ape it, people will still run it up. And then the, the other half of the tokens, the 14 billion tokens that he still holds, as you can see on chain right here, is going to be worth a lot more and he can donate to many more charities if he decides to dump it if he did decide to dump it as the top holder 
would that scare people away? No, because what we see in the past is that when Vitalik sells, when Vitalik dumps, the tokens pump, the token pump, people buy the token and they run it to a new all-time high, all because Vitalik interacted with the token. Okay, guys, so in my opinion, this one has a lot of potential. Okay, guys, and you will see that on Twitter, right, or X, whatever you want to call it these days, right, there's, it's getting a lot of attention now, okay? There's going to be people talking about it, people tweeting about it. You know, everyone wants to be the next 100x play caller, right? So, you know, why not tweet about it? Why not, you know, get your bids in early? Why not, you know, claim that glory later? Hey, listen, I talked about Ito at 5 million market cap. Now it's 500 million market cap, guys. You know, that's 100x. Why didn't you listen to me, right? So that's going to be what people are doing later but are you going to be late to the party or are you going to bite the bullet on this one i think that you know we have a lot of potential in it it's at that type of market cap where you don't have to put a huge amount of money into it because of course it is a speculative play and you know you can always lose your money don't risk more than what you can afford to lose because this is cryptocurrency anything can happen right you could buy it today vitalik could dump it tomorrow and you're feeling wrecked. And, you know, if, if you are patient, of course, it's going to come back up. But do I see that happening? No, of course not. You know, Vitalik just sold a couple of days ago. He's not a serial dumper. Okay, guys. Although he does dump when he's ready to dump. He does what he wants to do. But, you know, ultimately, you know, he's going to do things which are for the good of his chain, the Ethereum blockchain. And uh, right now, Ito is definitely in a position to make some waves in his space, potentially. And especially with Nero running to the heights that it's running, that is going to be very bullish for Ito as the beta play in this crypto bull run narrative meme coins cycle. Okay, guys, so that's really all I've got for you in this video. Let me know what you think in the comments. Do me a favor and subscribe to the channel. Tick the little bell for notifications. I'll leave the link of the, in the description for the correct Ito. Okay, guys, and I'll see you in the very next video.